Hi there, ladies and gentle beans. Uh, how's it going? Good to see ya. Now with a camera that's not completely balls and from like 10 years ago. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So I figured it's about time that I did a, a proper channel update because of all the stuff that's been kind of going on. So uh, yeah, get ready for that horribly unscripted, possibly jump cut riddled mess. Before we continue, though, I would definitely just like to give a nice happy thank you to those uh, cool beans who uh, showed up yesterday for my Maiden solo stream. Uh, that was actually a really fun time. I'll talk a little bit more about that in a bit, but uh, yeah, let's, um, let's get to talking updates. So let's start off by talking a little bit about the channel. This thing here, where the video lives, my main channel. I'm sure some astute viewers have noticed that this channel, which was once populated with uh, reasonably produced content that came out maybe every once every three years, is now being populated with random Let's Play nonsense that's been coming out on a rather daily basis now. In fact, it's been coming out on a daily basis for, uh, for a couple months now. This is probably going to continue. I'm actually having a lot of fun doing LPs, and I'm having a lot of fun uh, doing, like, getting more into streaming, so uh, that's something that I'm definitely wanting to kind of expand on a little bit more, especially uh, considering everything else, again, that's been kind of kind of happening with me personally. So that's uh, something that I am really, really, really uh, digging and really, really wanting to continue. All that old stuff is still going to be up there, uh, obviously, but uh, I, I just can't find it in me to keep doing stuff like that and actually have it done on a regular basis. That's not to say that I might not try doing a couple of other things at some point, but uh, yeah, right now I'm just going to focus on this for, uh, for a little bit, I think. As far as the actual LPs go, I am quite a ways into Titanfall 2 right about now. That's been kind of my main focus, um, and uh, yeah, that game is fucking good. I love the campaign in that. Um, definitely uh, go check those out if you haven't already. I'm actually uh, planning on posting the, uh, the the last few episodes back to back so that they get done a little bit quicker. Up until this point I've been posting an episode of that coupled with one of my other side playthroughs. Uh, but uh, yeah, I, I feel like it'll get a little, it'll get done faster if I do it this way and that way I can move on to bigger and better things possibly a little bit more quickly. Yay! So yeah, go check that out if you haven't already. The other two playthroughs that I'm kind of going through right now are uh, Fury, which is a neat little uh, kind of boss rush dueling game that's got sword fighting and bullet hell shooting in it. It's freaking weird but cool. As well as Puyo Puyo Tetris. That's also still a thing. Um, and it's a, it's a really weird thing. Like, holy crap. These freaking LP's Tetris blocks are both an asset and a curse. I always end up placing them in, in terrible places. It's awful. Then there are these goddamn red S pieces. It's the red ones that always mess me up too. That's why I suck at that thing. God damn it. Oh shit. So yeah, check those out too if you haven't already. It's all uh, it's all in good fun. And I've also got a couple of fun ones that'll be coming up very shortly as well. Um, one of them being a all-time favorite of mine, so I'm really, really, really looking forward to, to sharing those experiences with you and possibly doing terribly at it as well. Hehe. <laughs> I'll leave it at this, you'll be seeing a lot of barrel rolls very shortly. As far as streaming goes, uh, like I said previously, uh, I actually did my uh, very first uh, on my own uh, stream on Twitch, uh, yesterday, where, uh, I ended up, uh, chilling out for, like, two hours playing, uh, this fun little thing right here. This is a nifty-ass game, by the way. Um, so yeah, that was, uh, super fun. I had a lot of fun doing it, and I'm kind of hoping to make that into a little bit more of a regularly occurring thing. I don't know how regularly, but, uh, I, I definitely want to, to kind of get a little bit more into that. Um, although I do prefer prioritizing this, uh, this recorded playthrough stuff just because I feel like I can pace myself by doing the, uh, the, the recorded stuff better, but I definitely do want to get more into some of the live stuff as well, so we'll see what happens, I guess. Naturally, I'll still be doing the Wednesday streams with my brother Hoax, uh, which is just one of many contributing factors to why I'm trying to go in the direction that I am right now. One of many. Many, 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 many. 
So yeah, on that note, I am going to basically be doing all of my live stuff whenever I do them on Twitch from now on. I kind of experimented with using YouTube Live slash YouTube Gaming, but uh, I'm noticing that their system is a little bit weird, their connection seems to be really choppy, and for whatever reason, their stupid event scheduler keeps forgetting what time zone I live in. It's fucking weird. But with my one experience with, uh, my one proper experience with Twitch, I found out that it is a way better system and I'm just going to be using that from now on. So, uh, follow me there if you, uh, if you want to check any of that. My screen name is the same there as it is here. So, yeah. By the time this is up, uh, my archive of the Breath of the Wild, uh, stream will be up on here, so if you missed it there, then why not go and check it out now, and you can see me be terrible at puzzles, and getting killed by pig people, and chasing after a teal-ass horse, what the hell? I want that thing, man! As far as things that are going on outside of my channel, I would like to take a moment to talk about visual cracks, because that is also a thing that I do. In fact, it is a thing that I do with my roommate. If you haven't seen that, it's basically just a kind of a gameplay series where uh, we, as well as a couple of our other friends at some points, basically just, you know, play stuff, usually older stuff, and uh, make fun of it, and I randomly edit dumb bullshit in between clips and stuff like that, and it's fun, and it's all good, and it often showcases the fact that both he and I have shit for vision. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah. We have not been posting videos on that channel for a couple of months, uh, for reasons that I will explain very shortly. But we are getting back to uh, doing it very, very shortly. Um, I'm hoping to have videos start going up uh, as late as the end of next week. So get ready for that if you aren't already. In addition to the regular stuff that we do on that channel, we also started a sub-series where we've been focusing on edutainment games. And uh, that's proven to be kind of nifty as well. Uh, we're doing a bunch of Magic School Bus games in the near future, and uh, we also managed to score a copy of a really, really obscure educational game. D educational in air quotes, huge air quotes, uh, called Turnaround Turtle, and it's the weirdest thing ever, and... I and we are the only channel that seems to actually have footage of that because we could not find it anywhere. We could not. We could not find that anywhere else. So, um, I'm actually quite happy to say that we have a, we we, we have a bit of a gem on our channel. So, uh, definitely check that out if you if you do feel so inclined. We're also thinking about doing a couple of other things as well as trying to do podcasts more frequently, but uh, all that kind of remains to be seen. But uh, as far as what's established, there is definitely more coming. In fact, I'll actually let you in on a little secret. Some of those videos may or may not involve a funny little 3D webcam that Microsoft released for the Xbox 360 back in the day. It's gonna be an adventure. Don't worry, you'll get it. And I'm sure the two people who actually regularly watch that stuff are probably wondering, why did you have a random kind of unannounced hiatus? Well, a lot of that actually has to do with IRL stuff involving academia. Woohoohoo! Yes, as of last year, I started going back to school, and both my roommate and I are actually both studying a radio broadcast program, and it's super freaking neat, and the both of us might actually be doing some volunteer work over there over the summer. Uh, but, uh, yeah, uh, the, the amount of uh, final projects that they kind of had dropped on us near the second uh, half of the second semester kind of made it unfeasible slash... Um, undesirable to keep working on that kind of stuff, because it's like, oh, I just worked on all this stuff, I want to take a break now, and, uh. So yeah, that's pretty much the reason why Visual Cracks kind of just randomly stopped. So, uh, yeah. There's the excuse. But it's coming back, and it's gonna be better than ever, I hope. That's actually another contributing factor to why I kind of wanted to start doing Let's Plays and stuff, because, uh, uh, considering that one of the things that I'll actually be doing at some point is uh, doing live shows on an actual FM radio station, um, I figured, hey, why not use this as a neat little platform to kind of work on some dynamic commenting skills and, you know, just kind of working on uh, good announcing voices or something like that. I don't know, it, it, it seemed like a good idea at the time, and uh, now I'm really feeling it, so, you know, yay. 
feeling it all day, every day, yo. So yeah, that's pretty much the gist of everything that's going on right now, so, uh, yeah, hopefully there will be many, many, many fun times ahead. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next video, which will probably be an LP or something. Till then, take care.